Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. My name's Margot, thanks for dropping by. I have another grocery haul for you today and also a meal plan. So and I hope you're all doing good as well. So let's get started. Okay, so I'll start on this end. Okay, I got a Sara Lee pound cake. Uh, I got some broccoli, frozen broccoli. Got some mushrooms, we've already opened those. I have some mushrooms, have bananas. Pepsi, have some milk, heavy whipping cream. Uh, let's see, I've got some ground turkey, some chops, some chicken drumsticks. I got some strawberries and some raspberries, some potato chips. Uh, I have paper towels and then um, dental floss. <laughs> And a hook. <laughs> uh, let's see what else I got. We've got some baby bell cheeses. My husband likes those. Yogurts for me. Got some raspberry jello. Got some uh, whipping cream. Got some baked beans. Some ravioli for my husband for lunch. Got some flour. Uh, got some buns. We've got some sandwich meats, chicken and turkey breast. Uh, got some whole wheat bread. Got some uh, rice, boil in the bag rice. You know, if, if you find it hard to um, make rice, if you do the boil in the bag, it always comes out great. You know, you can't go wrong. It uh, always comes out lovely, you know? So I, I recommend success boil in the bag. It's really good. Uh, so we've got some Swiss cheese and some provolone cheese. My husband's favorite Pop-Tarts, brown sugar and cinnamon. Um, oh, I managed to find some uh, McVitie's digestive biscuits in the supermarkets. Me and my husband are gonna try, well, I know what they taste like, I don't think he does, but we're gonna try those. That was a nice surprise to get those, or something from home. Uh, some Reese's peanut butter cookies, they're my husband's favorites. And um, we got some sage stuffing, and we got some townhouse crackers. Oh, and we also got the uh, Pepperidge Farm cookies, my favourite. Oatmeal and milk chocolate. Okay. And we got some TV dinners for lunches. Lean Cuisine grilled chicken. Fredo pasto, chicken and broccoli. Uh, meatloaf and the fried chicken. They're lunches for my husband. Um, let's see. Did I miss anything out? I think that's everything. Yeah. So also I'm going to do a meal plan, which I wrote down, which starts... Um, on Monday so um, this Monday so I don't know if you can see I'll read it out Monday we'll, hopefully we'll have pork chops rice broccoli and carrots Tuesday we'll have chicken drumsticks mac and cheese peas and broccoli Wednesday turkey burgers and rice baked beans and broccoli Thursday quiche sweet corn broccoli and a baked potato Friday, penne pasta bake, and Saturday, pizza and the leftover pasta, and Sunday we'll have shepherd's pie. So that's my meal plan, my meal plan for next week. Um, I already had some of the ingredients in my meal plan. I already had some in my freezer in my cupboards. So, you know, isn't every, some of it's here, but a lot of it I also had already had. So my total groceries came to $147.9, and nine, sorry, I'll say that again, $147.99, but that's dollars and cents. And I also had coupons for three dollars, so it would have cost um, you know, an extra three on that. So groceries were $147.99, and I also had three dollars and coupons too. And also we got a big pack of water, but that's over there somewhere. <laughs> it's too heavy to put on the countertop. <laughs> so anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed my uh, grocery haul from Maya. That's my local supermarket here in the Midwest. And I hope you enjoyed looking at my meal plan for next week. Um, and if you could